how you can get many games on PlayStation 4 free. This method is going to show you how you can get many games on PlayStation 4 free. In this case, you, in my case, I can get over 150 games for free. In my case, in my case that is, it might be different on you, but we're going to get into that in a second. But just to let you know, uh, you have the chance to win a free iPhone 11 for Christmas. If you check out my other videos, you can see the giveaway video I uploaded about getting a free gold iPhone 11 for Christmas time. If you follow the instructions, which is just to subscribe, like, and comment. If you comment, I can see that you I can enter into the giveaway and I can contact you near Christmas time because the idea is that the winner gets the phone for Christmas. But anyway, enough of that. Uh, I'll show you how to get many free games on PlayStation. Now. So, fire it up, click on your account. And you want to add your friends account. Basically, I have over 150 games. 150 games. Oh my. 150 games, right? So my friend can get 150 games if he wants to. He has the option to get 150 games for free from me if he wanted to. And you can do the same with your friend, but all you've got to do is add his account. So you could say, um, right, I'll tell you what, can we switch accounts so we can use each other's games, right? Which is what me and him do. But that's how I have loads of games, and he has loads of games as well. So, start off by adding his account, right? Once you've added his account, you sign into his account. Once you've signed into his account, you go on to settings. When you go on to settings, you click on account management. Then, you click on activate as your primary PlayStation, PS4, sorry. You activate it. What this does is, it is enables his account to be your main like PlayStation setup, so all his games are available to every account in your PlayStation, which means you will have any game he has that you, you can now have for free. So my friend now has 170 games. He can download any game he wants from there. That's over 170 games he can have, man. It's a lot of games. And uh, if you don't have online and you want to go online with your mate. And uh, you know, he has online, you don't. It's the same thing. He, you, you can get his PSN through activating on your PlayStation, which is class. You don't have Xbox as well, but it's quite much more than Xbox. So, uh, yeah, that's one method, but you just make sure that you make you come to an agreement so maybe he can use your account, you can use his account. For example, you want like, this particular game you don't have, but you have online and he doesn't, so you switch, you switch accounts. And then bang, you can like, you know, you can use each other's online. Another way you probably already know, which I'm just going to say anyway in case you don't, PlayStation Plus benefits. Uh, I've got over 70 PSN games from PlayStation Plus. It all adds up, you know what I mean? I've got loads and loads and loads and loads of games. Good quality games like Titanfall, you know, Last of Us, Batman, Sniper Elite Ball, they're all good games. So that, that's the legit methods that you can do for those type of games. I mean, for example, I'm able to play Cod Wall, Cod, the new Cod, because he shared with me. Well, you can play like any game that I have over 170. So if you run short on your games and you may, if you may have loads of games, just ask him. Bear in mind, it's not physical games. It has to be like uh, games that you bought in the store because it's digitally shared. So anyway. Thanks for watching.